Good morning. Today is Tuesday, July 5th, 2016. I'm just playing during the smart events. Go, well, a piece continue higher on Friday. It didn't set the world on fire, but higher nonetheless. So far, almost a do-over from the Brexit deal. Unfortunately, future's a little weak pre-market, so it could be a bumpy ride. You know me. I'm not going to get too excited about this market until and unless it can make it to new highs. Let's take a look at the NASDAQ. As you can see, decent day there, too. Eh, up a little bit more than a third of a percent, almost half of a percent. Unfortunately, though, it still has a lot of work cut out for it, a lot of overhead supply to deal with. Ditto for the Rusty. In fact, that chart way out, and you go all the way back to 2013, as you can see, not a whole lot of forward progress in a long, long time. Stop me if you heard that before. As far as the sectors, some areas, such as gold and commodity, take it off in here, so we could see some new setups there soon. Other than that, not seeing a whole lot just yet. A lot of areas of retrace back up to their new highs, like the market and follow through, will be key. So what do we do? Well, for the most part, you might want to just, just want to sit on your hands. He tried to say and let things shake out uh, a bit. Any questions, usual with David, David, I'm just Landry, and you start the market minute.